I'm very let down by wolves in sheep's clothing. You know what I mean, brothers and sisters. People that say they're Christian, people that use the term God, and the world looks at them and goes, those people are hypocrites. I want nothing to do with religion. That's just hypocritical stuff, right? So here is a poster for the king's men, right? Jesus Christ is the king of kings. Are these the king's men? These are popular pastors, preachers. These are people that are supposed to be working for Jesus Christ. Kirk Franklin, he's like a gospel singer or a gospel conductor. I'm not sure exactly. But he's supposed to be a Christian for Jesus. And I will say this, brothers and sisters, in looking through their social media, etc., the, the term God comes up quite a bit, but the terms, the, the words, the name Jesus Christ doesn't come up very often. Kirk Franklin has the sign of success on his hand. In this current world, the way things are, the sign of success is 666. Hollywood, we know about the industries of the world. Hollywood is probably the worst. Hollywood, from a tree, is used to make witches' wands. Hollywood Confidential with Kirk Franklin, um, those things don't mix together. He's got some worldly awards, stuff that if you really knew the truth about Jesus and the truth about the world, why would you want like disgusting Hollywood to give you pieces of metal and, you know, be like, oh, we like your stuff. You're one of us, right? Like, why would you want that? And very seriously, Kirk Franklin's doing the Uttara Bodhi Mudra, a yoga gesture meaning enlightenment, but it is Satan's false enlightenment. He's doing it with all the other Illuminati members, right? So he's supposed to be for Jesus Christ? The Uttara Bodhi Mudra, enlightenment and faith in Jesus don't mix together. Marvin Sapp is another one of those gentlemen featured. He's doing the Yoni Mudra. He's doing it again there. He's doing it again here. You know, people of God, they stand beside and take pictures with the really expensive cars when the world is what it is. He's got the sign of success on his hand, 666. And very seriously, it's, it's in a silhouette, so you can't see it as good, but he's doing the Uttara Bodhi Mudra in a silhouette. How clever. Israel Houghton. Houghton, he is darkening one of his eyes with an I voted sticker for one eye symbolism. Donnie McClurkin has got the sign of success on his hand. He's got the sign of success on his hand and worldly awards. So pointing this out, you know, again, these people are supposed to be big representatives of Jesus Christ, our Lord and Savior worldly awards you know whatever that like my take on it is right like i said why would you want awards from those people from this world right you know the people that do all the freemason satanic signs and symbols that's where those awards come from and in the bible talks about golden idols and people worship them more than god a few of them did the utara bodhi mudra enlightenment we know that it's the false enlightenment from satan this world is incredibly deceptive. Videos like this I'm making, right? Not everyone's going to like it or get it, but these are men supposed to be representing God very well. None of us are perfect, but when you clearly do the world, Freemason, Satanic, signs and symbols, what are we to think? Trust God first, everyone. God bless you.